The 147th annual Westminster Dog Show kicked off today in Queens. This year, the three-day event is at the historic Billie Jean King National Tennis Center in Flushing Meadows, Corona Park. John Elliott brings us more on day one of all the fun. <laughs> The sun is out and it's a great day for a dog dip. Today we're at the Canine Celebration Day, which is part of Westminster Week. And there's so many fun activities. We have the Masters Agility Championship, the Masters Obedience Championship, and something new this year, dock diving at Westminster. And don't worry if you're a short dog, they measure dock to tail, not the nose. Oh, and when it comes to agility training, here's a life lesson. They have to run the course clean and then fast. So when it comes to obstacles, just don't hit anything and then speed up. Best in show winner from last year, five-year-old Trumpet the Bloodhound made an appearance, but now I guess we should call him Trumpet the Ambassador. Chris, what's it like to have a champion at the end of your leash? Uh, I tell you, there's nothing like it. He, I'm very proud of him. Uh, he's such a social dog. He's an ambassador for our breed. We have over 3,000 of the top dogs in their sports in New York. And the best part about it is that the 2,500 that are in the dog show itself come from 49 states, with the largest entry coming from California. These days, more than ever, we need good news. And loving dogs and having fun with your dog, like people are doing here this week, is what it's all about. At the Billie Jean King National Tennis Center in Queens, where we're getting ready to crown the next king and queen of the canine world, I'm dog lover John Elliott, CBS2 News. Woof. That's a dog lover for yeah. sure.